What's up, T.O.? Sorry to make you yeah. stand, because I know you just got two new knees. Yeah, no problem, Gab. We got new new knee, left knee in January, new right knee in, in uh, March, seven weeks ago, and I was out here practicing on the track, and it didn't feel too bad, but I, I didn't want to push my luck and race, but it was, uh, yeah, my knees, my knees are hanging in there, but, man, watching the guys out there is pretty freaking awesome. It looks like... It looks like you brought the, I mean, SE's kind of like, like this, <laughs> this Dirty Fest is made for SE. It looks like you guys are everywhere. So what's, what was the marketing plan, Todd? <laughs> well, we've got a new team manager, uh, Jimmy Surfer on Instagram. You know, he's, he's setting up this whole deal at all the races. He's going to state races, he's going to national races on the West Coast. He's got like, we have two different teams. We've got a flyer team and a ripper team, you know, these little kids on uh, okay. strider bikes, okay. you know? So it's like, he's trying to build up this whole like grassroots thing and, it, and it's working, you know? So it's like, and it's awesome because now we finally have a presence again. We didn't really have much of a presence at the BMX races, but uh, yeah, anyway, this is the first time I've like really, I've, I've seen pictures and stuff, but now I'm seeing it. It's like, man, he's got eight tents out here and he's got like a little training area and he's got a little entertainment area and he's got a little snack area, you know? It's, he ain't messing around. So that means you have to step up your game for D-blocks? <laughs> Now D blocks don't. He he just wants to ride. Okay. <laughs> well, I saw some wheelie people out here. Who who's out here that we might want to yeah. look out for? Who's not a racer per yeah. se? Yeah, one of our wheelie guys, our, uh, Matt Ricard, RL RL Matt Ricard, I think, um, on Instagram. But anyway, he's uh yeah, he's, he lives up in NorCal. We we're supposed to have a couple other guys down here, but didn't work out. But but I think tomorrow there'll be some other wheelie guys here. When we did Frogtown, you know, like there's some wheelie guys there that came just to hang out and check out BMX. And what's really cool, I was just talking to somebody, it's like, you know, I think we have, I think 400,000 followers on our Instagram. You know, we've got, we've got, we've got more, uh, I think our, our YouTube, we have over 200,000. We have more YouTube followers than any other BMX brand. We, we keep track of everything. Anyway, but we've, we put a lot of stuff, you know, we're not just a wheelie company, you know, we're not a bike life company, you know, we put a lot of, you know, in the last week we've hyped up this dirty fest a lot, you know? Yeah, so yeah. it makes me feel good that like these kids that don't know nothing about racing in general are like kind of like learning at least a little bit like, yeah. oh shit, BMX racing. Look, look at that. Look, look how interesting that is, you know? So it's, it's, you know, I, I like to kind of spread it around and the same thing with you know, thinking we, we did a, you know, we did four years of a Mike Buff bike, you yeah, know, different yeah. different models. We did a Stu Thompson bike. Right. We did a Perry you Kramer bike. Me on it. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> anyway, we'll get, we'll get that later. <laughs> anyway, but but think of that these these kids, you know, just wheelie kids, young fifteen year old kid that have never even raced before. Now they 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 know Stu Thompson's name. They yeah. know Mike Buff's name. They That's know right. Perry Kramer's name. Maybe they research them a little bit and kind of learn a little bit about BMX and and grant and obviously the whole. The bigger picture would be how awesome is it if, you know, you can't twist anyone's arms, but if these kids actually go to a BMX track, you know, the wheelie guys right, right. go to a BMX track, you know, and, and we did that about four years ago. We rented a school bus up mm -hmm. in up in Harlem. We, we Harlem, yeah, York, yeah. yeah, Harlem at, at Rucker Park. Loaded up like 40 kids and we went to, we to a track. We you practiced. Went to Kingston. Yeah, we went, we went to one track and practiced yeah. for a few hours, then we went to another track and, had, and they raced, you know. Nice, so, nice. so we're trying to introduce these bike life kids to BMX. You know? Crossover life. Yeah, exactly. And, it, and I, I don't think I don't think it worked, <laughs> but it's good effort. Yeah.